Television presenter and singer Michaela Strachan has become a firm favorite with viewers since she first hit screens in the 1980s presenting Saturday morning television. Until 2009, she was a regular on BBC's agricultural series Country File, and still hosts similar shows such as Spring Watch, Autumn Watch, and Winter Watch. Her current partner is Nick Chevalier, but she was once married to Duncan Chard. Michaela was married to filmmaker Duncan Chard, who became her husband in 1996. They divorced five years later in 2001 when the presenter was 39. She has said in the past the marriage ended because she realized she wanted to have children, but Duncan did not. Speaking to the Times, she explained she hadn't been desperate to have children when she first got married. She added, but I changed my mind. It was quite a fundamental difference between us and it ended the marriage. Two years after the divorce, Michaela started dating cameraman Nick Chevalier after meeting him in Cape Town. She explained not getting married was the couple's secret to a happy relationship. I think the secret is not to get married, she revealed, adding, I shouldn't say that. That could be taken well out of context. But maybe the secret is we're apart a lot. Speaking to the mirror, she added, we don't get on each other's nerves as much as maybe we would if we were together all the time. We're both into the outdoors, we're both into wildlife, being outdoors, being fit. We're very like-minded people. We're very good friends and get on really well. The 55-year-old has one child with Nick, a son named Ollie, who was born in 2006. She also has three stepchildren from her partner's previous marriage, Jade, who's 34, and twin boys Tom and Sam, 32. She told The Times, when I got together with Nick, I thought he might feel he didn't want a fourth child of his own. But it all worked out. He adores Ollie. She also once described the moment she knew Nick was the one. In 2018, she recalled, I live behind Table Mountain National Park. Walking there with my dog Rio has become my solace. It's also where I met my husband Nick. I was in Cape Town, and a friend introduced us. Talking to you magazine, she continued, after a long walk up the mountain together, a bottle of wine at the top and a cable car down, I knew he was the one. Michaela lives in Cape Town with Nick and their children.